Hey everybody, this is Lupo and today I will show you how to build a welcome light using the Xiaomi window or door sensor and a simple Zigbee light. So what is a welcome light? Maybe you have the same problem. You went out for a drink in the evening and then you come home and it's super dark. You enter the apartment and then you have to find this damn switch in the dark. Ow! <laughs> So to solve that, I want to use a window sensor to signal that the door is open during the night and then switch on the light. Quite easy. So let's start. So a few words about my experience with the window sensor from Xiaomi. So it's super small and it works out of the box because the battery is already inside. It works, you just press the button, you wait some seconds and you're already online and you can see it in your system. You can also test it and as you can see here in the video, it's super snappy, it's super fast, it reacts really quickly on the change. So I was really impressed because usually for Zigbee it's, it's a way slower with lights. To install a window sensor, it's super easy, there's already a double-sided tape on it so you just peel the backing off you press it on the door and that's it so we can already start with our automation so with the logic behind it i'm using a home assistant system here but in general it works very similar with all the systems out there so we start with a new automation we have to define a trigger so in our case the trigger is of course the window sensor when it's open we want to do something we also specify some conditions here because I want to have the welcome light only during the night when it's dark. So as a condition, we can use the sun state. So there we can react on the sunset or sunrise or any state in between by using some offsets. In our case, we would define after sunset and before sunrise. But as it is an and condition, so it would be before sunrise and after sunset, it wouldn't work because it's always the same day. So Home Assistant considers always the same day. Therefore, we have to use an OR statement. So we define the state of the sun should be after sunset or now in another state, the sun should be in the state before sunrise. So that would be the period from midnight to sunrise and the other one would be the period from sunset to midnight, but on a different day. I also want that my welcome light works a bit longer because usually it's a bit darker already before the sunset. So I define here minus one hour and also for the sunrise plus one hour so that it's active one hour after the sunrise and one hour before the sunset. And then we can already go to our actions that should be executed. So of course I want to turn on my corridor light. I specify the corridor light here, turn it on. But I also want to turn on my light in the living room because I always go to the living room. So I also specify my living room. It's called sofa light because it's close to the sofa and I also want to turn it on. So as I'm always walking to the living room, I also want to turn off my corridor light after some minutes. So let's say three minutes and I can add a delay here. So three minutes in this case. And after the three minutes, I can turn off my light again. So I define here the corridor light again and define to turn off my corridor light. And that's already it. Now I just have to wait until it's dark and then we can try it out. So I'm in front of my um, apartment and now the moment of truth has come. So let's see if the solution really works, if I can somehow open the door. Let's see. Yeah! As you could see, it was quite simple to build this home automation, this welcome light. Of course, there are tons of improvements and if you have an idea how to improve it, please write a comment or subscribe to my channel so that I can build more of those videos to give some guidance how you can build stuff with your home automation system. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Ciao. Have you seen what I made? What I made? 
Mind Made Light.